It's, it's been really interesting uh, uh, looking at all this work from the last 20 years of my life, the progression in the work, and to see how um, intense the things have become over, over time. But I also think about, you know, who I was when I made that work and, you know, roads that I didn't quite finish. Maybe there's like something left to be said from that body of work that I sort of like race through on to the next thing. A lot of my work has been predicated on, uh, on certain suppositions and as the work has progressed, uh, a palimpsest of information kind of gets added on to each work. I think they've gotten more um, conceptually dense and more visually dense as I've proceeded as an artist. And there's also a lot more intuition and sort of evanescent impulses that I'm responding to as an artist. And uh, that's kind of created a, a, another sensibility that I don't think was there initially. You know, when I'm working with the material, I try to turn off my head a little bit and just sort of be more intuitive. Uh, honestly. I mean, I have ideas that kind of are sort of presuppositions to the work, but when I'm actually making the work, uh, I'm not really very intellectual. You know, I don't like to say, oh, I need an illustration here versus a phot photograph over here. Um, for me, it's just like kind of what feels right, and I don't really uh, question that, that, that process too much. Um, it, for me, it's been the key to the growth of the work, is just to sort of let it sing through my body.